Hello, good day and welcome back to this edition of our presentation. Still on our dear sister Ruth Matthew, I trust that you're okay. We're focusing on the stepdaughter today. That is a very important person in this whole case of the missing child. Important for the fact that she was present on the day uh, the son, baby testimony, vanished. And she should be able to share her views. I asked previously on one video where she was, but thank goodness she has spoken. So I will get us to listen to her. Well, I was going to play the video, but the sound was not um, obeying us. So we would listen to her, a bit of her views of the day, and then I'll be coming back to share. So let's listen to her, what Joy Ayo has to say. Today is uh, 30 August 2022. Here is Joy, the lady that accomplished uh, Matthew to Mercy City. That is the stepdaughter that followed her to Mercy City. So, we want to interview her to tell us exactly what she knows about this issue of baby testimony missing. So, just all over the world, you can hear us out right now. What is your name? Your name is Joy. Okay, you are the one that followed with Matthew to Mercy City. Okay, but you are you know that a baby miss when you go to Mercy City. Baby miss. Okay, where did you know about this baby when miss? What do you know about the matter? But are you sure that uh, it's not with Matthew that sent the child? I know. You, where you did that time where when the same baby piece, where you did? Then you are the children day the other side. I mean, where you the where the children day? Okay, who which people did the command of the church? Then the, the children root and the, the children where they did that time. Anyways, this is kind of Not a bit people, long, yeah. so I am going to pause it. If you really want to listen to the entire speech from Joy Ayo, I would suggest you go on to Prof X's channel where you can hear her say her views. But the main thing I want to say is Joy Ayo did not throw with Matthew under the bus. She did not tell lies or say anything to deny the fact that the child is missing. Thank you, Joy, for your honest report. Uh, it is great to see and hear that the young woman was allowed to share her own views of the event that unfolded on that fateful day. She did not appear to be intimidated, manipulated, coerced, or threatened to say anything different from what she saw on that day. This young lady, she should be 21 plus now because she was 18 um, when the child disappeared. She has spoken. She's a woman now with her own mind. The child disappeared in that place. She went with her stepmother and her four brothers and they returned with only three of the children. 
Joy Ayo demonstrated kindness, compassion, maturity, independence, and love, which may not have been obvious in her words. She stood with family, unlike her father, who has continued to run with those who are against with Matthew. We will look at her father in the nearest future because he is important as well. But I want to say I salute you, Joy. Thank you. You are indeed a great person, although you do not know it yet. God bless you richly. We did not, you did not speak evil or lies against Ruth Matthew. Although she did not look presentable, if you watch the video, I am glad that that young lady appeared as herself. She wasn't acting in any way. That was who she is, and she was not changed. There were no makeup, no hairpiece no jewelries, nothing to make her look out of character. That was joy. And she spoke the way she would normally speak in real life. I pray that she finds support which is relevant to her situation as she desires because she came out to tell the story as it is. She did not try to please anybody. The child is missing from her account. She wasn't exactly present when the scenario, the whole scenario unfolded, but she saw the aftermath and she spoke in that light. Thank you, Joy. God bless you. You stood with family. You showed more love, compassion than your father. Our beloved son is still missing and we want to find him. If you were Ruth Matthew, or you were related to her in any way, what would you do? What would you do? Remain blessed.